Beep up diddly, beep up diddly, dee da diddly, dee da, da 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 da. Alright, sounds good. Alright. Alrighty. Welcome back, good people and goblins, to another Ikoria draft. Here with us once again, the Mr. Nick Della. Nick, what's up? What's up, what's up? The intro was uh, better than last time. I don't know what intro you're talking about. Uh, just your introduction to drafting. No, 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 no. Listen, this I was we, expecting more of like a, like a movie intro. So like, <clears throat> the world where mutating is a disease. A young planeswalker finds himself traveling through the packs of Ikoria in the quest for the seventh win. And seven fifty gems, or whatever else your gems you're getting. Can he do it? Find out in this action-packed thriller. Manasotan takes on Ikoria Draft. Coming to you this summer. Anyway. Listen, if you want to fight, you have my gamer tag. You have the hashtag at the end of it. We can run some standard, and I will beat you down in an hour and 37 minutes playing a team or rec deck. So send it on down, man. Send it on down. Exactly. Anyway, further ado, let's get the video, right? Oh yeah, no bro, that is all going in already. That's that's good. We don't we don't need to edit on this end. We are ready. At a table with three Teferis. Let's see it. Three Teferis. Let's see it. Three Teferis. Let's see. Uh, I bet you that Teferi is the one that's not uh, I got you forty seven gems, six packs of Guilds of Ravnica Allegiance, and a spin down life counter that it's not. Oh, I don't be that guy. Jeez. Aha! Sarkin. And we have... Ooh! The Abush! Yeah, it seems pretty straightforward here. Um... School them up. Uh, what else? Unbreakable bonds would be cool. Prickly marmoset is always fun, but yeah, I don't. You don't really pass on yeah. the seventeenth copy of Abush. Abush, the spider Pokemon. Oh, I mean, listen. If you want us to play all odd spells, I'm not gonna say no. But yeah, again, Grim Dancer seems to be the pick up here. Uh, pacifisms, sure. But, um, yeah, let's keep it odd. I like it, I like it. Hmm. Could go Evolving Wilds, could take the Pacifism. I don't like the Black Mentor that much. Um, I think Pacifism is the pick here, man. Where is your head at? Um. Are you playing green at all? Um, nah, it doesn't matter. I mean, I'm not. I'm not like anti-green. You know, it's all peace, yeah, love, and happiness here. But why? What's green that I'm missing? I just love Bushwhacker and his cousin, uh, Bushy oh Maul. Oh my gosh! The doing guys, they're odd. They are I'm odd crazy. creatures. No, yeah, they go fast as well. Yeah. Generals Enforcer. <laughs> Interesting. Odd. Uh, Forbidden Friendship gives us even tokens. There's another Black Mentor. Again, not too crazy about it. Do we just take the Enforcer? I'm probably going to find error here. Error over Enforcer. Ooh. Uh, I'm, on, I'm on General Enforcer over Error, man. Hey, take it. I dig the removal. Um, You know, but... I think the Enforcer's like just... Just kind of like a premium card. 
Inspired ultimatum. Okay. Um, in terms of black white, there's a. Hmm. Is there a black white human abush deck? Black and white is definitely in human colors. <laughs> as far as an abush deck, I'm pretty sure someone's done it. Uh, it's. Ah, uh, someone's done. Okay, all right. I'm gonna go check on YouTube now. <laughs> Black, white, human, abush deck. No, I think it sounds weird. I kind of want to go with him. Um, banishing blade. I'm not. I don't really. I'm not too thrilled with. All right, it's gonna be weird, man. But let's try it out. Let's try it out. Hmm. So boneyard lurker is the strongest card in this pack. Um, oh. thus we could play it as a black card. Um, <clears throat> pack six frost link essence scatters. Interesting. Uh, I think we just go boneyard lurker. Um, keep it like that. It's kind of anti-human, but you know, it's just a little speculation. We could run general enforcer as a just a two drop. Yeah, what's your thoughts on companions post? Companion bands uh, in draft. Uh, have you ever done it, or have you uh, messed around with that at all? Yeah, I would say they're in the same boat as playing an agent right now. Ooh, bum 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 Yeah, you just I don't know. I just don't, don't think they're. Yeah. Only companion I think is worth playing is maybe Urian. Mm -hmm. But still, even then, you're risking uh, a Urian to play 80 card deck. But still, I think the 80 card, 80 card deck is still pretty good. Like all those cards have good cards in it. Mm -hmm. It was done right, of course. Yeah. So, um, I don't know. I'm not... Like, aggro players, Abush, Loros, those Loros decks, I think it hits hard. Yeah. Because you usually cut, cut stuff on mana, so, like, playing three for a Loros is like, a big deal for them. Yeah. Why is Heron, Heron wheeled around the table? I don't know, man. <clears throat> People don't like Heron. blue. I love yeah. blue. I love you. That is cool. Menace? I mean, hmm. You have the Farfinder, too. <clears throat> yeah, do you have a Farfinder? Ah, uh, probably the safer pick. This Menace guy, though, man, I don't know. Esper Obosh sounds really ridiculous. Uh, I think Farfinder is the safe pick here. Fair enough. We do go Farfinder. I'm holding up the table. That's no good. Uh, we'll take a Tranquil Cove just in case there's a weird, weird, weird place we go with this. I don't think we're taking the green land here. Tenant Connection. If we end up some weird menace thing on the side, although this guy is odd, maybe we do an Abzan thing without a hair? I don't know. We'll see. Very little downside to this. Marshall over save yeah. Let's do that. Take a keep save for the board, why not? Sure. And here we go. Team or trio. <clears throat> Flame spill. Heron number two. Farfinder number two. I mean, in a world where I'm playing red, I scoop a flame spill, no problem, no questions asked. Uh, if I have two dream herons, I'm very happy with that. Hmm. Where's your head going on this one? On this one? Yeah. Uh, it's tough. It's tough. You're definitely not playing red, right? So I think you're more white, black, navy blue. Yeah, I don't mind. Or yeah. Another heron, or yeah, yeah, either the vigilance guy or the fox. Oh, that's where I'm at. Not the yeah. fox, but the fox bird. Yeah. All right. I might take the goat here. 
team or yeah, anything. Yeah, another pack where you're not missing too much, nothing too crazy. No. There's a scatter, but I don't think I'm playing blue that early. Um, red, black, land. Uh, I don't I think I'm more inclined to take a goat. Yeah, I don't think I have any... Probably going to be cycling anything. Snare would be interesting, but... He's going to play. Do you have some weird subhuman thing? If I don't really know if that's going to mesh well with the Dream Tyrant, but... Alright, let's scoop up. Go. Bond and Night Squad Commander... I guess we go with the first butch meat here. Um, Solid card, I like it. Yeah. I think we're missing it. Man, there, there, there was a rock slide that's getting passed too. Someone loves you. Passing them a fame slow rock slide. What is my removal? Non existent, right? You have one pacifism. Uh, we'll stay true. All right, the guy in the back of me definitely loves me. He's getting Cloud Piercer, Serpents, all the removal in the world. Are we making this Flash guy work? I don't think so, all right? Black, black. You, you're up black, right? And you are playing blue? Yeah, but as a 3-2, do you have anything else that's Flash? Nah, Bone I, I mean the... <laughs> Let's go two Butch Meat Poachers and see... Excuse me, um... Yeah, I'm gonna give a dead eye lurker, right? No. That's all we got to be flash for block. Yeah, let's go. All right, we'll take, we'll take it, we'll take it. We'll see what's up. We'll see if anything weird happens. I'm always game for it. Dirtle bug. Boom, boom, boom. Dirtle bug. Yeah. Um. Looks like the pick here. Um. Coilblow, we do have an otter. Like I said, I don't know how heavy I want to lean into this this blue thing. We do have a bunch of humans. Maybe I just cut them and then stick blue you black. Just go white. Just go white. Yeah, blue black. Might be the way to go. First otter over coil bug. I think so. Two herons. Put white over here. And they're giving these butch meat uh, poachers off for free. Yeah. We don't want them. This is the second um, drain of healer I'm seeing too. Uh, but I think we take poacher here. Got a divine error. We have a like a fifth ram through, which is crazy. Cathartic yeah. reunion we're playing. Think Divine Arrow. Maybe we do stay with white? the white. Well, well, I, I'm, I'm, well, I'm missing a dinosaur, which is probably not right. there. I'm not playing green. Could run Tribal okay. Sleeper Dart again. Wow. This is saying a lot. So I should just take the essence scatter. Saying, hey, play green. Play green. Green's open. Pick me. Pick me. Yeah, people do not like. Do not like this. Well, I mean, this is back to right now. Yeah. Over mutual destruction. Do I? Uh... Ah. Let me take this. We have two herrings. A lurker. Crystal for the board. Yeah, weird stuff. Cross links, I suppose. Don't have any two drops though. Um, all right, we'll pick up. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, we do need a curve out though. I guess we're going Esper Obosh. That's weird. This is really weird. Today's podcast is brought to you by. 
what the hell is going on? Seven grand <laughs> Yeah. All right. So I think we take the coil bug. Yeah. <laughs> we take the coil bug. <laughs> I legit think we take the coil bug though. I don't. I don't like. I get take space Godzilla. Are you rare drafting? Nah. Uh, I have. I think I have four of those. Uh, ah. Honestly, I just think I take coil bug here, man. This is it sounds really, yeah, really weird. The but... meat, right? Yeah. Alright. Yeah, alright. One two pack, one pick one. Oh my god. Alright, well we have Blood Curdle here, so that's that's the pick. Yeah. Um This is interesting. Um but What did he get? Turtle <laughs> Turtle Bug <laughs> This is this is just the, the it's the new meta man, honestly. It's an oh my what is going on? The whoever's passing you does not like black. Listen, I'm a full supporter of uh, diversity in this game. No, uh, dude, pack three, pick three. We're getting past this bomb. All right, buddy. I'm you. You're c come on, come on, come with me. I'll give you a good home. Hey, I didn't get any of this. I love you. Oh, oh my, my goodness gracious! <laughs> I don't <want> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, what a good pick. All right, so it are we just blue black at this point? Um, I have zero two drops for no. I have a uh, baby Godzilla. Durable bug. Durable bug. Right here. I'm not missing any two drops. I need to capture sphere here. Um, highlight it. Yeah, I'm not playing red, so that would have been still been interesting, but I'll go with the removal. Dire Tactics gives me a reason to play white, so I think we're going to go there and then just put white back in. Uh, thousand percent. Okay. Black, red land, don't need. Black, two black, black green. What? Uh, you're not green. For some reason, I think I've seen so many Ramsers on your screen that I think you're green. <laughs> Literally, <laughs> no, no one is green in the sable, and it's it's fascinating. So I think I'm gonna highlight the otter, dark bargain. I'm not playing. Don't need green. Don't need a red black land. So I think we should go here. Frost links. Um, Frost links number one. Yeah, I think we take it. Yeah, I don't need any rares. We got all the gems we need. Um, got all the holy ram, ram through. through. So I told you, man, that podcast dropped where they said green is terrible, terrible, terrible. Obviously, people at this table have what listen to the podcast and do not believe in the power of green. Depressing. Is green that bad? I think green's good. I, and again, I think if we were in a place where. My black green decks always do crazy good. Oh, dude, the, the, the those mutate decks are, are phenomenal. But and then my what is it? Band, my band decks are nice too. Mm -hmm. And Sultai. Yeah. Thank you, Land. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I guess we take a Fangs. This is weird. Very, very, very weird. Uh, Esper Obosh. I freaking love it. This is beautiful. We did it. We made it work. It is going to be done. And go. We got some gems out of this, too. Jesus Christmas. Good thing no one watches the end of the videos. The average viewer YouTube on YouTube is three minutes. All right. Cut this out. Uh, blue, black, blue, blue, blue. I think we just start cutting humans to start. Yeah, so trim some lands real quick. <clears throat> um, survive. So we'll go dire tactics on four. Uh, let's just cut first. Cut dark bargain. Curdles in, bone yard lurkers in, butcher vultures in, 
Day Squad Marshal's probably out. Heron's in. Obosh is in. Chittister's in. He's probably out. Keep, keep, keep. Night Squad Commando one off, sure. Slither Wisp, ah, uh, maybe. I don't have anything flashed, all right? He's just literally a three mana, three two that I'm never going to be able to cast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Land situation looking like four, five. Right. Drop this over, drop this down, drop this over. Okay. Yeah. Shoot us around five. Sabretooth, baby Godzilla. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Yeah, three different color two drops is different. Oh, geez. All right. This looks like we're going to tinker with the lands a little bit, get it all done and out, play test it, and see where we go from there. Thanks for stopping in. Um, if you like what you see, if you had fun with it, if you have any recommendations, comments, anything you want to say down below, let me know. Always great to have the conversation started, and let's keep it going. Once again, stay safe. Thanks for hanging out, and see you next time.